Oh, suppose you have 3.76 DAM and then you are to change that into the number of kilometers. DAM to kilometers. So you are moving now, okay, to the to the left. Okay, so there should be a movement also of the decimal point two places to the left. And so what will be the result? What will be the result? Okay. Good. So, you put the answer here na. 0. Point. Uh, there, there is only one movement if you did that. Kasi from the 3.76, you be careful with that one. Kasi 0 will be included in the number of this uh, decimal place and then the zero that you have here is not included in the two kasi from the am diba one and then two okay so from the original place wherein it's three point three is one decimal place and then you have to add another one okay so that's the correct answer zero point zero three seven six nakuha that's the reason why this table is very important para it will become faster when you do the the conversion okay that is also applicable like for example you have a uh, 7.55 grams and you want to get the equivalent of this into milligram uh, what will you have there 7.5 grams to milligrams That's a measure of weight. Seven, five, and then. Okay, very good. So there are three movements from gram to milligram. So from uh, decagram uh, to de decigram, that's times 10. That's another times 10 and then another times 10. Okay. Nakuha. So 7,500 milligram. Did you copy the table? Then try to memorize this K M H M D A M M D M C M and then M M. Okay, question with that with this one. Nakuha. Oh, what about if you have, for example, three point twenty two liters, and then I want you to give the equivalent in hectoliter. 3.22 liters to hectoliter. What will you get? Liter to hectoliter. Okay, so there are two movements also. So from liter one to so the movement is to the left. Therefore, you have to move two decimal places to the left. Very good. Oh, see, you learn fast. That's nice.